Hey guys, what's up? It's Caitlin. Welcome back to my channel, and if you're new, welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing another thrift flip. You guys seem to really like one of my last videos where I did a thrift flip, so I'm going to be doing another one just because I really love doing them. I saw the cutest little yellow plaid shirt in the thrift store the other day, and I just had to get it. It was $5. I'm going to put up a little video over here of what it looks like on me, but I decided that I wanted to go ahead and make it into an overall dress. I looked up on Pinterest a DIY plaid shirts, and I found the perfect inspiration, and it actually had a YouTube video. And and so I'm going to kind of put that in the description bar below because even though I didn't copy it to a T, um, I did use it as an inspiration and it was a really big help. I actually just started sewing recently, but I really like to make outfits and so it kind of helped me technically to make mine even though I kind of made mine a little bit differently if that makes any sense. So definitely check out that video as well. Um, but yeah, today I'm going to be making a yellow plaid dress with little buckle clips. I hope you guys enjoy, and let's go ahead and jump right into it. This is the top. I got it in a size large, so I had enough fabric to make the skirt. And so the first thing I did is I went ahead and cut off the neck of the shirt as well as the arms. And then after that, I just cut off the extra fabric because I know I don't want my skirt to be that long. So once I'm done cutting off the extra fabric, the next thing that I'm, you're going to see me do is just kind of fit the skirt to myself and then cut off the extra fabric that I don't need. Open eye Feel the waves cut through me Hypnotized By the sounds I'm breathing As I'm cutting off the extra fabric, I just make sure to leave enough room so that way I can sew the piece together. Once I'm done with this, I go ahead and sew the piece together. This is like the third time I've sewn it together. I just want to make sure that it, you know, lasted for a long time. And then after that, I just went ahead and did the seam along the top so that way it looked really neat and put together. tried on the skirt right after this and it was still a little bit big so right here you just see me tailoring in the skirt a little bit in the back just so that way it fits me better after that you're gonna see me take these sleeves and go ahead and cut the sleeves in half and then after that I just go ahead and take three inches wide of a section and go ahead and cut out the pieces for the straps of my overall dress Once I'm done with both my straps, you're going to see me go ahead and sew the clips on to both my straps and then sew them on to the skirt itself.
So the last thing I do is go ahead and add a little Velcro piece to the top of the skirt. I honestly wouldn't have had to do this if I would have paid attention to where the buttons were located, but that was my bad. So this is a skirt once it's completely finished and you're about to see a before and after. And that is the yellow plaid dress I came up with. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to give it a big thumbs up as well as subscribe to my channel. Leave in the comment section below if you guys like my outfit. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.